What's going on, guys? I just wanted to put out a quick update. Uh, this is a major, major deal. I want to share this with you today because um, you're going to need to know this. They basically just patched Madden 22, and they made a huge, huge shift that's going to change, I think, everything on the defensive side of the ball. Um, and what it is is basically the way that the – instant pancakes happen when you come out in a dime set they basically patch that and now um that's not exactly what's happening so i'm going to show you a couple of examples here in just a second and then i'm going to talk a little bit about what we can do with this defensively now if you're struggling on defense in madden 22 i know it's hard they actually just said that they're not going to fix the zones in this patch so get my defensive guide there's a link in the description below and you're going to be able to get instant pressure we have a five-man pressure that comes in against gun bunch max protect super good blitzes out of this so if you want to get access to the defensive guide there's a link in the description where you can get it for just 15 dollars. but anyways let's dive right in i just want to first come out we're going to come out in halfback base and um, what was happening, uh, a couple different things. So uh, first and foremost, like let's say I come out in dime 146. I'm going to come out in my favorite play, uh, which is a dime 146 crossfire, if I can find it. Um, but what was basically happening, maybe they don't have it in this playbook, uh, but what was basically happening was the defense was essentially falling down instantly. So I will right, we'll just come out in Tampa too. It's not a big deal. I just want to show you this. So um, all we're going to do is we're just going to zone out, and we're only going to blitz three. And before, this would be a pancake. Now, watch what happens. You see they don't get pancaked, and then it's basically just run defense, right? Your defense holds the line, which allows you then to shoot gaps or blow the run up however you see fit. Okay, so now let me just kind of take some, some chess pieces off of the board here, and we're going to zone out all of our linebackers. So we're only blitzing. Um, we're only going to blitz one. Okay, so I'm only going to blitz one person. I just want you to watch what happens. Snap the ball, and what you'll see is – there's really no pancake. I only put one person and there's no pancakes. So let's take it just one little step further here. I'm gonna drop everybody in a zone. Not a spy, not a bluff blitz, not a no, no, a zone. Everybody's in a zone and I'm gonna pass commit. Now watch what happens. You see there's no pancake. There's no pancake and I drop 12 or 11 people into coverage out of gun bunch, okay? That's out of gun bunch. So now what I want to do is take it a step further. What we used to do last year was essentially if we didn't want to play people that were running dime one four six, we would put running backs or tight ends in, and if we saw dime one four six, we would just audible down into one of these strong eyes or eye formations. So I'm just going to come out in strong H slot power O, and I'm going to come out in dime one four six. So we're going to start with just blitzing three. Then I want to show you what's going to happen. You're going to see here. We get instant pancaked. Why? Because we blitzed three, okay? So now we're gonna blitz four, okay? So that's basically three with a blitzed user. You see here, the pancakes are still a thing, okay? Out of strong H slot, strong H slot, okay? Now, as you notice, I have two tight ends, okay? Really important, I have two tight ends, okay? Now, let me show you this with two running backs. You should see it's gonna be a little bit different. So I'm gonna put an extra running back in there and we're gonna do the same thing. So I'm gonna blitz four, snap the ball, and what you'll see here is instant pancakes. So basically the point is, now we have to kind of go back to that old strategy of if we see Dom 146, we need to do this. Now what I will also say though, is let's say for example, let's say I go to the Dime 236. Okay, test it out. You see, oh, no pancakes. Interesting, isn't it? The thing is, now uh, I just find it really interesting that I can go to one other formation, which is basically the same personnel, but I don't get pancake now. Look at that. I don't get pancake. And I'm only blitzing three. I'm only blitzing three people. Okay, so let's take this just a little bit further. And we're going to come out in goal line. So the weak box counts are now very different. And uh, this is why I think you're going to see things like $3.26 are going to make a major comeback in this game. So two three six will, it works. I can come out in two three six will and be fine. And I'll show that in just a minute. Prevent, I'm not going to go over that, but I'm just going to go over two three six. So one four six and two three six. They look exactly the same. They look exactly the same. They basically have the same personnel, except you just add a defensive lineman. So I'm just going to come out. Let me see if I can find a good defense here. Uh, I'm just going to come out and, like, cover cover two hard flat. So I'm only blitzing three people. Okay, cover two hard flat. I'm in goal line, which is, has, you know, heavy run set, right? Look, they're not, they're not getting pancaked. 
they're not getting instantly pancaked like they were um, out of dial 146. Now let me let me show you another thing. So is the inverse true? So if I go to dial 146, watch this. Dial 146, they pancake them. Isn't that interesting? They pancake out of dime 146, but they don't pancake out of dime 236. So what that just communicates is dollar is back. Dime 236 is back. Here I did get pancaked out of this goal line set, but as you saw with strongly slot, you're not going to get pancaked. So the bottom line is we have very little tools on defense this year. This is a tool. You can now go to dollar or dime 236 and let me see if I have, I don't think I have dollar on the other side of the ball, but let me just see if I do. But we can go to dollar and be fine. And essentially what we just found out was if you add a lineman, if you add a lineman to it, it helps your weak box. So three, two, six, three linemen for goal line. Three, you see what I'm saying? It seems like the coding is basically a lineman for every tight end. Okay, so now let me just come back out and let me see. I still only have two, three, six here, unfortunately. Um, Prevent, I think this three deep has, is technically a three down lineman set. So let me just come out and go line. So I'm in prevent and just watch what happens. Look at that. See what? See that's what I'm saying. So three down lineman because it's a quarter. Um, it's a man up three deep. So man up three deep is coded as three down lineman, right? Because you see how their hands are all on the ground. That's three. That means three down lineman. So now you have three down lineman. So if they come out and goal line, you see I don't get pancaked. I don't get pancaked. Now yeah I don't you know uh, corners do from a tight end, but the linemen don't get pancaked. So what we can now do. This is to kind of illustrate the dollar three two six because it's a three down lineman set. You could do something like this, and then you could shoot gaps. Now I just held goal line to one yard. Okay, that's what's that's what's coming, and so I would encourage you look for a playbook with dollar three two six and start trying it out because you're gonna find that you're not gonna struggle as much as you have in the past to stop running sets, which allows you to do two things. It allows you to put more cornerbacks on the field, which we need this year. And secondly, it allows you more opportunities for pressure. So stay tuned on that. If you want to get the defensive guide, there's a link in the description below. Anything that changes will update you on from a patch perspective. We've tested all the blitzes out. They still work. In fact, they work even better post-patch. So try that out. Thanks a lot for your support. If you want to get my defensive ebook, there's a link in the description. This is a major deal. This is huge, 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 huge deal for Madden 22.